Right, I am now in Brighton and I have come to YMCA. This, this street that I'm on, it's actually in Hove, not Brighton. It's just filled with charity shops. I think I've been here once before on one of my vlogs it, on, on this street in particular. Um, this YMCA across from me has quite a lot of good stuff actually quite a lot of good furniture and stuff like that i'm after number one a hat stand and i'm after something for my dressing room or something for my office so um i'm just on the lookout for things if something jumps at me then obviously i will take it but otherwise i won't I don't know if that sounds normal. Also, my parking is on such a wonk. <laughs> wow, Diane. I'm just gonna walk away from that car because it's scaring me. That's my car, by the way. And it really does not sound good. Look at that parking. Are you sure that's not gonna blow up? If anyone knows why that is making that noise, please let me know in the comments. Oi, oi, oi. I'm in the car. I had quite a successful shopping day. I got Joe some clothes for our holiday. I got I got one thing for me. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I struggled to find anything for myself. I was mainly looking for Joe though, to be fair. Uh, I'm starving, so I got a little snack of chickpeas. Dried crypt chickpeas are actually so good. Mmm, delightful. I feel like I've been gone since this morning, which I have. So I got Joe a few little bits and bobs for our holiday, which I cannot wait for him to see. But I also got, what did I get Joe then? Don't tell me I forgot to put something in. Something's fallen out of the bag. Shut up. Or unless I just didn't put them on the thing. Finally time to show you how my kefir went because I can't actually let it process for too much longer. It's been over 24 hours now. And if you watched my last video, we made the start of my kefir. Now it's time to actually see the finished product. Try it. Again, you're gonna have to watch the video before this to see what I actually did to make it like this first. Now, in here, I put coconut water and the grains that I had already sort of made come to life, if that makes sense. So now, I am going to strain this. So, so basically, I kind of want to keep that in there, actually. So, this is now my kefir water. It's all very confusing, isn't it? Even I'm getting confused. So I'm gonna try a little bit of it now. And this is pure, good. Ah, don't waste any. So I don't think you'll need too much of this, to be honest. Let's try it. It tastes like, it actually tastes really good. It definitely tastes fermented, obviously. The smell is something you need to get used to. It's got like a it's got like a tingly taste to it. <laughs> that makes sense, like a tingle. I think I've done it right. My mum's gonna watch this. She's gonna call me and she's either gonna say, Diane, what were you doing? Or no, that's right, it's just a different one. See, my mum uses milk to do it, but this one here that I got is actually water kefir. It's not milk kefir. So I think it tastes pretty good. It actually tastes a bit like kombucha in a way. Um, I like it. It's a fermented, it's a very, like Joe's going to absolutely hate that. He will not drink that. I can guarantee you now. But I mean, that just means there's more for me. So what we need to do is remake a new batch of kefir because obviously this will not last forever. I also have a little jar that I'm going to put it in. So uh, I don't know if I should maybe be 
I should probably be making the kefir in this, I feel. That's what I'm gonna do. Making an awful lot of mess here, but as you can see, there we go. There's me little babies right there. And that is my kefir that is gonna keep growing and growing. So each time I make one, that will just like multiply. Yeah. Let me know if you're interested in this journey of kefir making with me. It, um, I, I mean, I find it super interesting. There's my new kefir. So basically now what I have to do to this is add sugar and water to this and then that will create the next bout. So I think I've still got some coconut water left. Okay, I'm gonna use what I have left, which is the coconut water, because actually it needs sugar to feed off. That's why you use milk or they say sugar water. There we go. And now we, I'm not gonna put the jar on because I think it needs a bit more breathing space. So I'm gonna put this back on it. And you can be with me on this little journey. We'll check in on my next vlog that I do and um, see how my kefir babies are going. They're literally my little babies. I am very, very impressed with my kefir water. You only need like a tiny bit of this a day. Wow, it's potent. It's very potent. but it's very good. And just like that, the day is almost over. I am now going to show Joe what I got him from Zara. And update, I actually did not buy the shorts. I know I was having a panic before. I was like, where are the shorts? But I must have dropped them as I was going around in the shop. Anyway, I still got him some bits. So Joe. Do you want to come and have a look? It's still not being washed, but that's okay. That is on tomorrow's job because tomorrow we are indeed going out. I'm going to sleep tonight with a bit of Moroccan oil in it. That's what I'll do. Give it a little bit of moisture. Just like soaks it up at the moment. Mm. Take a seat on my couch, please. It's like you're coming to the doctors. No, no. <laughs> Is it in here? Now, congratulations. Do you know I had to also... I can tell they did not put this in the bag. No, I had to do it. And do you know how long it took me? It's so complicated. Yeah, you've got to do it yourself till that now. Yeah. Ooh. I think these are nice. I hope you like yeah, them. Yeah, I like that. Do ya? Yeah. So I've got Joe this shirt. I can wear it to work. I really like that. Ooh, I like green. I like a collared shirt. I know. And it's in the sale. Yeah, that one was yeah, in the I sale. Like that as well. That's, That's nice, nice, isn't it? Yeah. Two for two. I really like this Ooh. one. This one's like a night time, let's go out for dinner. Yeah. Oh, and you know what? I've never really done the no collared shirt. But do you like it? Yeah, I'm ready to, I'm ready to give it a go, I reckon. I think that colour on rude, you. It doesn't matter, really. It doesn't matter. Why would you go West Country? I don't mind getting my nips out. Um, I nice. really, Thank really you. like that colour. That's very kind of you. I did have a pair Green. of shorts, but the shorts Green. have somehow got mi gone missing. My favourite. I'm going to go the start of the green one. Really? That's your no, first favourite? No, it's in like, I'm just putting that down. Uh. Like this. Over this. I did think as well that they could be shirts that you could wear to work. They're all very nice, actually. Yeah, it's, like, it's not. It's really difficult. Normally, I'm so when, glad you like. Do you know like how long normally, I went into H and M as well? Like but H and M, nah, not yeah. the one for boys. I feel like normally, well, I've never really got an H and M to be honest. But normally, when you buy me stuff, more than one thing, there's usually one that I'll be like, mm, no, really, I can't. Good. Can't fault you here. I think I'd, I'd wear all of them. Oh, I'm so glad. Let's do the tape, the taste test. We have a styling mirror. Quite a lot of styling mirrors, actually. <laughs> Everywhere you look, there's a mirror.
Oh yeah, that is nice, Joe. Oh, that looks so good on you. Sexy. I'm feeling sexy and free. You actually could be a model. Yeah, an Airfix model. That is nice. That's a holiday shirt. That is nice. That is a holiday shirt, isn't it? Oh, I love it. Ooh, I like it. Oh, that's really hot. Please come down a bit more. I think so. You look like Aladdin. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Man? I like it. Because you can see your necklace as well. Love the colour on you. <laughs> it's my favourite thing you do. Nice, Joe. Mm -hmm. Very happy with that haul and he looks so good in all of them right it is indeed bedtime even though it doesn't still look light outside it's quite late so i'm off to bed good night everyone i'll see you tomorrow happy making time um where excuse me let me do that again where has the sunshine gone honestly when i was in australia all i saw was videos of people enjoying the sun Getting a tan. Since I've been home, I haven't been able to sit outside really once. It's been too cold. I'm starting my day with a little shot of water kefir. I'm going to put it in these cute little cups as well that Poppy and Sean got us for Christmas last year. Cheers. That's actually a lot. Cheers. You can taste the pure goodness in that though. That's my new ritual. Before my coffee, to have a shot of kefir. Because it feels like that's just done wonders for my, for my insides. It's actually quite nice. It's probably bad to have two shots. We'll just do half a shot. It's actually really nice. These cups are the cutest things ever, by the way. You see, they don't hold much, but they actually hold a fair bit. She's had her coffee, she's done a workout. I am now going to make some breakfast. I'm gonna sit in the sunshine and enjoy it because the sun is actually out. I literally was just talking about the sun, wasn't I? And it's peeking out, but by the time I make my breakfast and go sit out there, I bet you the sun will go. No, positive, positive. Uh, I think I'll make myself, what am I gonna make myself? I think yogurt, a yogurt bowl. Let's make a yogurt bowl. I'm gonna use my new bowls that I got from the car boot sale. They have been washed, don't worry. But let me just give them one extra rinse. <laughs> yogurt i bought this yogurt the other day which i never normally buy from like a little market it looks good oh this looks like good yogurt you know this is a hundred percent cacao powder and i love mixing it's a very deep bowl this so you can hardly see what i'm doing but mixing the cocoa with the yogurt it's so lovely Put a couple of straw frozen strawberries. Like berry rim. We have flaxseed. So I'm gonna put a little bit of flaxseed on top. Get some more seeds. I've got sunflower seeds and pumpkin seeds that we'll sprinkle on top. Cacao nibs. Ah, oh, of course. This is actually not peanut butter, this is almond butter. So a nice little dollop of that. And, guys, oh shit, that's where I'm getting greedy, damn it, she's dirty to the top already, it's only not even 9am, this is the finishing product, you wait for it, she's got edible flowers guys, I cannot deal with the fact I've got, I don't want to waste them, 
but we got little petals. Not one packet, but two packets. That is just too cute. I have to make this for Joe as well. Wow, look. Isn't she gorgeous? Isn't she lovely? Oh, little, the little things in life. Putting a little flower in your food has made me so happy today. Wow. Okay. I just made Joseph bear pancakes. Bear pancakes, bro. Bear pancakes, bro. Bear pancakes. Bear pancakes. And the big daddy one there has a sad face because all the little kids are being naughty. Yeah. He's like, why do I have so many kids? <laughs> Got leftover bears as well. These are the ones that didn't work. That was meant to be two eyes in a mouth, but just ended up being one big cyclops mm -hmm. but how cute are they like that is such a cute pancake for kids maybe but <laughs> but That's adults a... can enjoy it as well where's the mum in all this the mum is right here she's it's a single them. dad it's a single dad with yes. all these kids that's why he's sad they're, yeah he's got a lot of kids and you've already eaten one of them i've just eaten one of his kids he's fuming at you no i think actually i'm doing him a favor he's probably like actually get rid the more of i eat this the more that frown will turn upside down <laughs> that's my bet i have just been outside for the past probably hour and a half and it's so nice the weather <gasps> i just needed some vitamin d it was honestly so so lovely so i do have to go and get ready now because I have a car coming to pick me up in like an hour's time um, for Glasgow. But I wanted to show you this. I bought some fresh fruit before and Joe was like, what are you doing? Because I am trying this new thing where I soak my vegetables in a little bit of vinegar and water to get rid of all the pesticides that are in it. Let me know if you know anything about this because I find it quite interesting. I've, I've let them soak for quite a while now, but apparently it literally just gets rid of all the pesticides that are on your fruit and veg. And it doesn't make your fruit and veg taste like vinegar. Let's, let's see if that's true. Hang on. I cannot taste any vinegar. Mm -mm. I don't taste any vinegar at all. I'm at the airport and my flight's being delayed, which is fine. But do you know what's not fine? Is that I go shopping when I have more time. And there's actually quite a few good shops here at the Gatwick Airport. I've already bought a few things from Reese. Just having a little look at all the, all the sales that are on. I love Ted Baker stuff, so nice. And she's arrived. She's arrived. Oh my God, it is midnight, guys. I left at five o'clock today and it is now midnight. From my driver ringing me at five o'clock, actually I left at 5.30, but still. My driver rang me at five o'clock and said, uh, I'm out, I'm opposite the Premier Inn. I was like, but I'm at home. You need to pick me up from home to take me to the airport. And he was like, oh my God, I'm so sorry. So he drove to our house, picked me up, took me to the airport. I was still on time for my flight, thank God. But then my flight was like two and a half hours delayed. And then there was an issue with the car picking me up. And then there was also an issue when I got here to the hotel because the system was down, so they didn't know which room I was in. But we smile and it's, you know, I'm just tired, that's all, but it's, I'm absolutely fine. There's no no drama. I'm here, safe and sound, and that is the main thing. I do love this hotel. It's called the Radisson Red, not the Radisson Blue. And uh, I don't know why it's called the Radisson Red. I mean, there is red everywhere. <laughs> I love it, though. This is my kind of, this is my kind of bloody place. I'm going to get to bed because tomorrow I have a big big day i need to do well i'm doing the weakest link by the way i don't know if i'm allowed to tell you that but there you go 
you've heard it first from me. Shh. <laughs> Whoa, good morning in this red elevator. Good morning everyone i just got back from breakfast actually a really good breakfast wow gave me a little poached egg and avocado i didn't feel many of it because i was starving uh had that i've actually been up already washed my hair done a little bit of makeup so that they have a little bit of a base to work with because then they understand like what shape i'm going for do you know what i mean do you know what I mean? And then, what am I doing now? I don't know how I've made such a mess in this room and I've been in here less than 12 hours, actually. So, um, I'm going to pack all that up, brush my teeth, and I'm actually going to walk there because they do have a bus, but, you know, I like to get a little bit of fresh air, especially if I'm going to be inside most of the day and sat down. So, I'll make the, mo mo I'll make the most and go for a walk and walk myself to the studio which i can see from here so that is what i'm going to do also nikita's just called me he's here as well i didn't know but he's like babe do you have any toothpaste <laughs> so he's coming now to use my toothpaste um which i'm actually surprised that i remembered to pack toothpaste well done diane well done that's not a good angle for me. <laughs> Look, he's here! And I told them that you forgot your toothpaste. I already told them. Yes, yes I told them. Honestly, you actually saved me today because I, I would have been. He wouldn't have been able to speak everybody. at all. Yeah, I'll be. You know, actually, it happened to me before and I had to wear the mask for half a day. No, you didn't. Yeah, yeah, I had. I had. <laughs> anyway, I had to go to his room because he couldn't get to my room. Yeah. But we're doing the weakest link. And I, I just realized that I might, I might have watched yesterday night the wrong show. Because it, I don't think there are options. I think you're thinking of who wants to be a millionaire, babe. No, babe, no. no, no he, goes, no, no. he goes, I hope I get the 50-50 question. I was, I was like, so pumped about I was like, what's the 50-50 question? Are you sure you didn't? Did, did you watch the one where you phone a friend as well? <laughs> Shut up. Because <laughs> that's definitely not the right, not the right show, babe. <laughs> Says back. she who's done it once and left the first bloody Actually, round. Actually, that calms me down. Yeah, that what? Calmed me down. Oh, calmed you down. I thought you said counted me down. I was no, like, no, no, no. They, calm they calmed and me down. One more thing. Yeah. One Since more I thing. don't remember the names. Yeah. Diane's name is the only one which I know. Yes. I even know your surname. Oh my god. Yeah. So this is gonna, this is wrong. This so is I gonna, not good. I, I will have to eliminate you first, regardless. Yeah. Of you're gonna write Diane Buzzwell. <laughs> That's all, yeah, What's yeah. my middle name? I knew it. You did know it. Uh, it starts with an A. Is an L? Mm, it's got an L in it, and there's an A in it as well, and it rhymes with bear. Oh my god, I've given you the biggest clue. It bear? rhymes with bear. It bear. rhymes with bear. bear. Bail. Add a C um, onto that. Bicycle. Add a C and an L. Bicycle? No! Boy! Boy! Claire! Claire! Diane Claire! Oh my god, I've heard this for 38 shows exactly. and I still don't remember Exactly, exactly. Okay. We're coming! We're coming. Come on, Nikita, get your stuff. <gasps> Here we are! The studio. Oh gosh. There's the name. Jamelia looking amazing. Nikita. Ekansu. Oh, and there's the walk of shame. That right there is the walk of shame. Been there, done that. <laughs> and she's done the show i am on the train now i actually decided to take the train rather than a plane because i was like i can just get more stuff done on a train what are you guys like would you prefer to take a longer train or a shorter plane because when you think about it like yesterday i was in the airport for hours i left at five o'clock I didn't get there till midnight because of the delays and all this jazz. Here, it's like 
yeah, it's a four hour train ride, but, and then I have to get from the train to my house. But still, I think overall, the experience and the time is pretty much the same. I would much rather be on a train. And there were still shops at the train station. I'm addicted to shopping. attached to my string i'm attached guys hang on okay i've taken all my makeup off um which i wouldn't be able to do on a plane like i, I have so much space um and i went to olivia bonus i think i say that wrong every time on the way back and i got the cutest little candle there was actually a collection of them and i really want to get the rest of them how adorable is that candle to put in my office and it smells good and it's just so cute I love that they had lemons and they had limes they had like loads of different ones got that and I got some new earrings as well so I'm gonna take these out sorry you served me well on the show but I am gonna put in some new earrings which I just bought. How nice are they? I've been looking for a pair of like silver hoops like this for a long, 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 long time. Because I've got gold ones, but she doesn't have any silver ones. Cute, I oh, love, I love, 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 love them. I also got these little mini ones to put in these. So I think I'm gonna go with finally home what a long journey that was i ended up taking the train obviously because i told you when i was in the train uh, but it took about i reckon five six hours maybe of traveling prove it this um vlog yeah this woolly mammoth one is so funny the woolly mammoth vlog yeah because <laughs> you're the bit where you were like making out with the tree Oh, yes, my hugging, tree hugging. <laughs> yeah. Right, I'm going to bed because tomorrow we've got to wake up very early and you'll all find out why. Good night. See you all soon. Arrivederci. Sorry about this bad lighting right now because you can't even see me. <laughs> night, bye.